What's up guys? Welcome back to this brand new video. In this video, I'm gonna teach you guys how to improve your jumping regardless of your level. In this session, I had such an amazing time riding in lighter wind, which is quite unusual because it can be quite boring. But uh, yeah, it was great. So stay tuned and see you in the video. Woo. One, two, three. What's up people, welcome back to this brand new video. I'm currently at Kite Beach. Unfortunately, the wind is a lot less strong than I anticipated. So I brought my nine meter and I think I'm gonna do a bunch of unhook stuff. Roger and David are joining anytime soon. So the waves are pretty nice. And I don't know why, but it seems like nobody is on the water. So it's uh, gonna be a bunch of fun and stay tuned for the action. Uh, it feels like there's definitely some wind. I do have to be careful with my knees because they're still kind of recovering from the marathon I ran one and a half weeks ago. Uh, it was quite hectic. I ran it with zero preparation. The farthest I ran, I've ran was six kilometers. So it was pretty, pretty painful, but we made it. I just have to be creative with the conditions right now and take it from there. The waves are actually really beautiful, look at this. Woo! And it was really bad. Guys, I think because of the wind is so light, I'm not used to light wind, and my technique is like so different. Upwind wind riding trick, but you have the wave right there, and what you do is you just scarf against the wave and surf it, sort of, and then you can go way higher upwind. wind. Look at this. Woo. Oh. Oh! 
Oh, there's a wave coming down me! Oh. Go surfing! Yeah, we go surfing, little bit! Woo! 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 Down no, no. oh. How many tic tacs can we do in one jump? If you don't know what a tic tac is, it's like you spin your board with your hand up. So here we go. There's a cooker in the back. We have a little food. And we have wind. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, fuck. Okay, you ready? Yeah, these are going to go. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 Oh guys, look at this! Uh, it doesn't say too much, I think, for the GoPro, but uh, it's it's just perfect. I'm here kiting with my buddies, and I just got a little realization moment, and I just really wanted to say thank you all to all you guys for supporting me. Without you guys, I wouldn't be sitting here now in Cape Town on the beach, kite surfing as a job. I hope you like the content that we're producing, and I feel that the vlogs are getting better and better every time. So. That's really exciting and I might be able to do like some bigger things in the future but we just have to be patient and keep doing what we love and that's guiding and uh, sharing the stuff. So thanks guys. Woo. Woo. Oh no, oh no, oh, oh. Okay guys, that's all. Maybe, maybe, maybe. I think it doesn't matter what, what your level are. This tip will jump, make you jump higher, a lot higher. So the thing is, is that when you jump, you attempt to jump towards the kite, right? Because you know where the kite will pull you towards, just jump automatically. So if I want to jump right now, I go like this. And what you do by jumping to that side, is you're flying with the wind. So all the pressure you build, you're basically losing. But the difficult part is to jump to this correctly and also the more difficult part is to do it correctly on every jump because you tend to get tired during the session and then you tend to ease in this, in this momentum so don't jump forward it's very it's a very basic tip but especially in stronger winds it's very difficult to maintain good technique so what i do is you push your chest forward and your, your neck backward you really try to jump in the wind and keep your back like, like this and by doing so you hold the tension of the side way better and again the difficulty in this is not Guess what? They fucked up big time, so I'm bringing back a board. Oh. David is first gonna jump, and I'm gonna jump to the right, and then after that, after some advice, let's see if we can jump any higher. Okay, 
Alright, just chug worms that for the awesome the wind at the moment. So I'm here with King David, David. Yeah. So the thing is, it's really easy. Once you're riding, go a little bit more quick. And uh, the other thing is, it's very important, like poke your chest up forward and keep your back to like backwards the whole time. So you lean back even well in the air, you try to lean backwards into the kite. I can't. Okay, let's go buddy. You. David's gonna jump a new record. Yeah, with uh, some, some professional coaching. <laughs> go, 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 go. Okay, let's try another one. He's having the time of his life. One more, one more. Yeah, Woo, what the fuck? It's so crazy. Woo, hoo, hoo. Okay, I think it works. But, uh, what do you think? Is it useful or no? Let me know in the comments. Oh, let's go. So guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to subscribe. I would really appreciate it. And you can also keep up to date with the next video. Um, yeah, thanks again. See you in the next one. Ciao.